Sinister Chili here, back with a couple pod reviews actually. I'm going to be trying this Thai Chili. I actually got these, this is from the bag that uh, Tim from Volcanic Peppers gave me. Uh, be doing this one first. He couldn't tell me anything more than it was just a, a some kind of Thai chili. He said that uh, I think his daughter or something like that had picked the peppers for him so he wasn't too sure on all the varieties that I had picked out and that's another thing I'm going to be showing you some pods and maybe <clears throat> someone can help identify them for me. I'll also be doing a chocolate habanero and as you can see this is quite large I think I'll go ahead and do mystery chilies first so this is the first one some kind of orange variety I don't know I mean it looks like some wickedly deformed orange habanero and then here's another orange variety. It's almost like a orange boot. If they have those, I don't know. But if anyone has any ideas on these, go ahead and feel free to comment. <coughs> so I'll go ahead and do this tie first. Lots of seeds. It's got a nice fruity taste. <coughs> I'm giving it a moment because I'm not feeling any heat. It's a little bit of sizzle on the tongue. I wouldn't even begin to be able to <clears throat> rate that heat though. Be like a point one. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna do anything. It was a nice pod. Tasty. Has fruit taste to it. Pretty thick wall, lots of seeds. It's just on the tongue right now. Not even worth mentioning, really. I'll go ahead and let it sit a moment before I try the next pod. Alright. Next is the chocolate monster habanero. I think I'll actually cut this one open. Because I'm curious to see what it looks like. This would be my first chocolate habanero. Smells nice. Decent bit of seeds. Looks like it's pretty thick walled as well.
<coughs> that was a lot of pod. Trying to think how to describe the taste. Not too fruity. Just a tiny bit of sweetness. Kind of a floral taste. attacking my lips, my tongue, Whew. it's definitely attacking the tongue, kind of pins and needles all over the lip and the front of my tongue. Hundred percent sure, but I think the Scoville on this one was like four hundred thousand or so. Definitely hotter than an orange habanero. <clears throat> Starting to heat up in the chest. Starting to taper down now. Still going good on the tongue though. It's a bit spicier than I thought it would be. I think it's done now. <clears throat> Whew. That was tasty. I don't know how to describe the flavor. It had its own unique flavor. It was good though. I enjoyed the burn. I know a lot of people don't like the habanero burn, but I'm perfectly fine with it. Uh, uh, well, thanks Tim for the pods. And uh, I'll be sure to link him down below. You can get some of his uh, sauces or dust that he is very well known for. Thank you for watching.